Welcome to N1 Electrical Trade Theory. This is chapter nine on testing. Please remember to hit that subscribe button in support of this channel. Before a certificate of compliance, a COC may be issued, inspection and testing must be carried out by an authorized person. And here we have a sample of what a COC looks like in South Africa. An insulation or resistance test will be carried out after the supply is connected. The measured resistance indicates the condition of the insulation between two conductive parts. Three important things to take note of when carrying out an insulation resistance test. A minimum of 500 volts must be used when doing insulation resistance testing. Insulation resistance tester in the form of a mega and the insulation resistance must be a minimum of one mega ohm when carrying out your reading. To perform an insulation resistant test between conductors and earth, remember that all switches and miniature circuit breakers are on, all loads are disconnected, the live and neutral bars are connected, resistance must be at least one mega ohm when carrying out your reading, and the main switch and disconnector is switched off. Place one lead of the mega on the earth terminal in the distribution box and the other lead on the buzz bar, which must be bridged with the neutral bar. And the reading that you get should be at least one mega ohm. When performing an insulation resistance test between conductors, remember the main switch and disconnector is off, all switches and miniature circuit breakers on. Your reading should be at least one mega ohm. All lamps are out and all loads disconnected. Place one lead of the mega on the buzz bar in the distribution box and the other lead to the earth bar. And a good reading should be at least one mega ohm. To perform a polarity test at the points of consumption, this test will verify that the lamp installed in the system is connected to the current carrying conductor, which is our live phase, and not to the neutral inside the distribution box. One lead of the mega is connected to the center of the Edison bulb and the other lead to the distribution box. To test the effectiveness of this earth leakage unit, there's a test button which will simulate a fault. 